Hi, today I'm going to show you how to make a Ethernet um, patch cable. This is CAT6. Um, patch cable, you'll use this to connect uh, your computer um, directly to the router. Okay, so it's a straight through cable. In other words, the pin configuration will be the same on both sides. Okay, so um, start by removing the the cover here. All right. So inside here there are four pairs, four twisted pairs. Okay, you have an orange pair, a green pair, a blue pair, and a brown pair. Okay, so where you strip off the cover, be very careful because you, you might have nicked um, the cable. So um, what I normally do is I just pull down on the hold this and just pull down on the cable like this a little bit to get it out. Okay, so where we cut the cable is somewhere up here. We're going to be cutting that off. All right, the easiest way I find to put on the cables, okay, is to separate the orange twisted pair to the left, the brown twisted pair to the right, the green, the blue down. So you have that configuration. Okay. Then what you do, you untwist your orange first. Okay. With the orange white on the left. Okay. Untwist your green. The white green to the left of the blue and the solid green to the right of the blue twisted pair. Okay, untwist your blues. Okay, with the solid blue to the left and then finally untwist your brown pair. Okay, so the water is going to be white orange, orange, white green blue, white blue green, white brown, brown. Okay, and that's going to be the same on both sides. So now that you've got your order correct, put them together straight. Okay. Trim them off. Okay, so we have our RJ45 plug here. Okay, so with the pins facing you, you will then slide in your plug. So you can look through here, you must double check your colors. White, orange, orange, white, green, blue, white, blue, green, white, brown, brown. Okay. Um, because you pull down the cover of the cable, you should be able to just slowly put the cable back so that where the crimp, here's the crimp here, you must crimp down on the cable cover, not on the cables. Okay, also make sure that each of the colored cables are seated home. Okay, so once you've got the cover pushed in enough, we put it into our crimping tool, give it a good tight squeeze, and there we go. Nice clean job. So let's put the, a clip on the other side of the cable. Um, if you're going to be making short patch cables, um, I recommend you just buy the cable ready made. Uh, this sort of job is if you're going to be running cables through walls and through holes and uh, the cables are quite long and you're going to be uh, cables uh, uh, through channeling and stuff, then um, obviously you'll be running the cable first and then at the end um, putting on your clips. So let's just put another clip on here.
Okay, so here's the two ends of our patch cable. I have a cable tester here. And what it is, the top line of lights is for the left and the bottom line is for the right. So we can just go through and check that we have a cable which is passed. So this is a straight through which is a patch cable. So there's a patch cable. Thanks for watching.